Hello and welcome to this How Tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to use the Get and Transform query in Excel 2016. So to get started, we go under the Data tab. We can do it from a table, or we can start a new query from a workbook, CSV file if you have a mailing list, XML, and so on. We can do it from a database, or even other sources. We can even combine queries, and we have some options and settings there. But we're going to be doing it from a workbook, and I'll just go ahead and quickly locate that workbook. What's inside the workbook is simply just a quick table that I created, and it's located right here. So it's going to load that up for us. We can go ahead and select sheet one, which is where my table is at. And we can go ahead and edit it if we want. We have a few options here, and these we can remove columns. These null cells here are just simply empty cells. And I'll just remove one of those columns and leave the other null cell column right there. And we can finally close and load it into our document. And we have one error, and one of those errors is simply a formula that emits an error. And that was done on purpose so that we could actually see what happens there. We can discard that, and you can see that it shows up empty because our cell output an error there. We even have some quick style designs up here at the top. And if we double click our sheet one here, we can go ahead and edit it again if we want to. We can transpose it, make it vertical, make it horizontal, whatever we want. And I'll discard that and leave it as so. This has been a How Tech video tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.